Hi, I'm Marty Nemco, and this is another of my fictional short, short stories. This one is called Burning for Valentine's Day. I'm reading this playing the part of a woman. I am divorced, and especially with Valentine's Day coming up, I was feeling lonely. So I was glad when my friend Pippa asked me to join her and a few other women for, quote, a special Valentine's Day celebration in the woods. When I asked her to tell me about it, she said, trust me. I figured, okay, I'm up for a surprise adventure. The only thing she said, wear what'll make you feel like a goddess. I chose a white peasant blouse, a long, crepey, twirly, mauve skirt, and a tiara I wore at my wedding. She gave me GPS coordinates to enter into Google Maps. Then she said, just follow the directions on your phone and you'll get there. And I found myself at an open dirt area at the edge of a wood with three women, including Pippa, already there. She welcomed me with a warm smile. Next to her on the ground sat a black plastic bag filled with something I couldn't tell what. After chatting while waiting for, for other women to arrive, Pippa took the bag and walked us into the wood, deep into the wood. There, she asked us to each find some dry wood, some small pieces and some thicker ones. It was fun looking, like in a treasure hunt. She asked us to put the small wood in a pile on the ground as kindling and the thicker pieces on top. She lit it and voila, a fire. Then she had us dance around it. She said, sway, hold hands, whatever. Then she said, and now for our Valentine's Day ceremony. She reached into the black bag and removed a heart-shaped box of chocolate and tossed it into the fire. Melting chocolate smells good, but it seemed a waste of a nice box of chocolate. Next, she took a bouquet of roses and tossed it into the fire. It felt kind of sad seeing roses burning. Then she took a Ken doll, you know, Barbie and Ken, and fired it into the fire. I mean, I know, I know, men suck, but still. Finally, she took out a Barbie doll and didn't throw it into the fire. She slowly raised it up toward the sky and asked us to dance around the fire. I felt like opting out, but I was too shy to. I came away wondering whether, in the end, all this is going to lead to a better world. Anyway, that story is called Burning for Valentine's Day. As usual, I welcome your thumbs up and accept your thumbs down. I always look forward to your comments and especially like it if you hit the share button below. Share on your social media so that my efforts can have broader impact. And I am flattered if you choose to subscribe to my channel. And certainly would welcome you taking a look at any of my uh, 32 books. Uh, most relevant to this would be probably relationship stories. All 32 are on Amazon. Just go there and search on my name, Marty Nemko, N-E-M-K-O. And you will find more than you can stomach. In any event, I do thank you for watching. I am Marty Nemko.